meaning of sex. So I think there's more than one meaning of sex. Pleasure. You show affection. A physical activity. And I grew up in the church and it's supposed to be after you get married. I just share something physical. For a husband and wife to know each other. Procreation. That's it. <laughs> That's what I'm going with. Our younger generation is really ready for something new. They're really ready for a new sexual revolution. Sexual revolution. Why are our relationships so difficult these days? Why would you even think about getting married one day if the divorce rate is so high? The divorce think rate about is getting so high. Married. Theology of the body gives us the reasons behind the rules. It shows us we don't have to ignore my desires or your desires for love. On the contrary, they lead us to the truth and clarity instead of confusion. Clarity instead of clarity. Hi, I'm Jason Everett, and with me are Brian Butler and my wife, Kristalina Everett. Together, the three of us have authored the curriculum, Theology of the Body for Teens. Body for teens. We often receive very frequently asked questions about the curriculum. Now, we're going to run through the top five. What is the Theology of the Body for Teens program? It's a multidimensional tool that you can use to reach teenagers with this liberating teaching of the Theology of the Body. Now, we use the language of the culture and the things that teens know to help them we use things like stories and quotes of wisdom from saints and John Paul II. We use comprehension and discussion questions. We use an understanding of how teens learn today to be able to do things in different ways so that they can learn in the way that's best for them, meeting them where they are, but always calling them on higher, as John Paul II always did, to something much greater than maybe what they've experienced in the past. Now this is a tool, whether it's used in Catholic school religion classes or parish youth groups or parish CCD classes or even small study groups, it can really help teens to understand who they are, understand what their purpose is, and really help them to better understand their faith. What is the appropriate age for a student to use this curriculum? We've designed it so the average high school student, whether a freshman or a senior, will be able to grasp the concepts. Because there's some tough theology in there, but we do our best to bring it down to their level while still make it academically challenging. Secondly, you have to consider the issue of sexual maturity. We do discuss some sensitive topics, but we think the average Catholic high school student or the average high school student at a parish youth group or CCD class will be ready for this information. Is this something that will really interest the teens? Well, what interests teens? Love, relationships, sexuality, God. We take a deep look at these issues. Why do teens need the theology of the body? They are starving for the truth. They're hungry for something to give them real meaning and direction in their lives. They're looking for a reason to believe and a reason to be able to be part of the church. It sometimes asks them to make difficult decisions, decisions that go against maybe everything in the culture around them. Teens really want love more than anything. And when they see this program is helping them to find that love, they're getting excited about it. Will this curriculum make them feel guilty about the decisions of their past? No. We let them know that they can start over regardless of their past and that their past won't determine their future. We give them the tools to live it out, and we let them know it doesn't matter where you've been or what you've done. All that matters is where they go from here. I mean, Shakespeare wrote about it. Every pop singer sings about it. But the reality is, is that no one really defines love because love is not defined by words. The meaning of the human person, that's what he really got down to, was defining what, what is the meaning of the human person? Why are we here? What are we about? Sexual activity among young people is driven by hunger for love and reciting rules doesn't help. It doesn't touch them. If you're just doing it because your mom and dad said no and you shouldn't do this and shouldn't do that, at some point in time, you know, that, that can wear off. You know, it has to be a greater power that's, that's pushing you. Young people are hungry for purpose. And when we look back to God's original creative plan, we find the purpose. What theology of the body is, it's about what's inside of us. It's about being free to live what God has placed in our hearts. And that's what's so exciting about it. When you're learning about theology of the body, all of a sudden so many things make sense. Make sense. Yeah. I don't think a relationship can work out if 
both people don't have a relationship with God. I know he's there waiting for me to, you know, connect with him. It's very valuable, and that's the most sacred thing that you can give to somebody. Theology of the Body for Teens has been such an inspiration and astounding experience for me as a teen. Theology of the Body for Teens has been incredible. John Paul II's teaching is just so profound. It's honestly, I think one of the finest, one of the finest resources right now for young people in the entire church. I just think it's so cool how a woman is a piece of heaven and like when a man looks on a woman, he should see heaven. You know what I love about TOV for Teens, honestly, the youth ministry, I mean, you know what loves it? is that it's fun. Theology of the body! <laughs> the book has really brought it down to a teenage level. It opens your eyes to, okay, now I understand the concept. I see why I should live that way, and that's the way I want to live. With very practical examples, with analogies, with exercises, whether they've been very sexually active, or teenagers possibly who've never dated, and who really have sort of been preserved from all that, that wherever they are on the spectrum, they can very easily enter in. Theology of the body for teens, simply put, is the most powerful weapon that I've come across in all of my ministry to help teens in their relationship with God and to liberate them from the lies that they face every day.